Hi, for this WordPress tutorial we're going to take a look on how to add videos, photos, and other files to your site and that can include Word files, PDF files, video files, anything that you think will add value to your site. So let's go ahead, we're going to go into the Media tab over on the dashboard. And in the Media tab this shows us all of the forms that we already have. We also have some JPEGs, but let's go ahead and see what else we can find to add. I'm going to click on Add New, and I'm going to select a file from my computer, and let's say I'm going to pick a music file. And this is some stock music that I've got, so I'm going to go ahead and pick a track, and it's going to add that track. It's going to allow me to caption it. And it's also going to give me the file URL. So if I decide I'm going to go to, say, another site, and I want to attach this piece of music's location to that site, I can just copy and paste this address into that site. I'm going to click on Save All Changes for the moment. And now you can see in my media library, there is new music along with all of my other files. Along the top, it shows me that I have 13 files in this library altogether how many images, how much is audio, and how many of these are unattached, meaning that they are not put in any posts or pages that I have. As always, I can click on this button and it will select all of them to do a bulk action. I can also do this by the dates that things were uploaded to see which were newest or oldest. If I want to add a new library so I can further organize all of my files, I can do that as well. And if I want to add more I can either click on Add New here or Add New over here. So let's go ahead into one of my pages and let's see how I would attach this. I'm going to go into my This is the First Page page and I'm going to click at the bottom of my paragraph and go into Upload and Insert. When this comes up it allows me to pull a picture from my computer from a URL, which is a picture or any file that's anywhere else online, or from my media library. And I'm going to go ahead in and click on the stock music file I just put in and click Show. So I've got everything the way that I want it, and I want to go ahead and insert it into my post. And click on Preview Changes. So scrolling down, you can see that I've got a link now called Stock Music, and when I click on it, it brings up my audio. So that's a pretty neat and easy way to put anything that you want online. Now keep in mind, you may have a limit on how much you can put onto your WordPress account. If that's the case, you can just link anything in your posts or pages straight from a file that you upload into your cPanel's file manager on your server. So that's how we can go in and add more media to further personalize our WordPress pages. So thanks for listening. I hope this helped you out, and I'll see you at the next tutorial.